What is going on saxophone friends? This is Tyler Anderson with getasax.com. Now we've seen a lot of people asking on the internet, how do you use the new Yamaha YDS as a MIDI controller? So we made this quick video to just break it down. It's actually really simple. Um, so let's hop in and check it out. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do is we're going to plug a uh, micro USB cable into this port on the Yamaha YDS. And we're gonna put the other end of that into the computer. So from this point, uh, the first time that I put the, uh, connected the YDS to my computer, it automatically downloaded and installed the driver for the Yamaha YDS. I'm assuming that that will happen with most uh, up-to-date operating systems. If you have any issues, I would just check out Yamaha's website. Um, but it should just install automatically. So um, in order to check out how to use this as a MIDI controller, we are going to hop into Ableton Live. Um, and the first thing that I wanna do is find out which channel the MIDI is heading to. So I'm just gonna blow into the YES a little bit. Um, and I can see in my channels down here that uh, that first channel is being lit up. Um, for most DAWs, uh, this, should kind of happen on, on its own when you plug in a MIDI device. So um, I've got that plugged in and we are going to go ahead and use Isotopes Iris 2. Um, it's a synthesizer patch and we are gonna see how it sounds um, with the YDS. <laughs> So all that works really well. Uh, I've got a patch up here. You can see it's called uh, Glide Lead. Um, something to note as far as the range that um, it's gonna be picking up, you'll notice on the keyboard when I blow on a B that it's giving a concert A. That's because um, I am in one of the tenor patches right now. Um, so it is going to pass along the MIDI information that's associated with the patch that you're already in. So if I want to switch over to one of the berry patches, I'm playing a B and now I'm getting a D on here, so. Um, yeah, so there, there is the option to hop into the user presets, um, which we're gonna do a separate video for and set the YDS to um, send MIDI at whatever range you would like. Uh, just another quick example, um, I am going to hop in on this patch, just a different flavor. Uh, this is a bass patch. So there you have it everybody, that is how you use the new Yamaha YDS digital saxophone as a MIDI controller. Please let us know in the comments if you have any questions and everybody have a good day. All right, see ya.